Welcome to the Exact Contact tutorial series. In this tutorial, we are going to go over a number of options for capturing leads directly into your Exact Contact database, including the option to build your own customized contact form that you can add to your existing website. If you are already receiving email leads from one or more websites or lead vendors, you can take advantage of our email lead capture option. To enable email lead capture, Go to your user profile by clicking the button in the top right corner of the page and click the lead capture tab. About halfway down the page, you will see a section titled lead capture email. Check the enable lead capture via email box below and your unique lead capture email address appears underneath. In your website or lead vendor setup area, change your notification email address to your exact contact lead capture email address and your leads will automatically flow into your exact contact database. If you are receiving leads from Zillow, you can check out our online help to find out how to set up Zillow to have these leads flow directly into your CRM. If you would like to build your own lead capture form, scroll down to the next section of the page titled lead capture build your own form. With minimal HTML skills or some help from your website designer, you can create an elegant lead capture form and add it to your website, either as a pop-up form or embed it directly into an existing page. Setting up your form is a simple three-step process. The first step is to customize what you want your form to say and look like. First, set the title of your form. We have set the default to contact me, but you can set this to whatever you wish. For instance, if you were part of a team, you might want to change it to contact us. The following selections assume that you have already set up your email header. This is not required, but if you would like to include your photo or your logo on, uh, or a customized email header on your lead capture form, you will need to set up your email header first. If you have set up a standard email header, the following options will appear. In addition to including your contact information on your lead capture form, you can also include your photo and your logo that you uploaded as part of your email header. Your contact information is the information that you provided when you first signed up for exact contact and is the same information that appears on your standard email header. You can edit this information by going to the contact and address tab in your user profile. If you have set up a custom email header, there will only be one option here, which will simply allow you to include the custom header at the top of your lead capture form. Next, set the text that you want to appear above the form fields. We have set a default of please complete the form below, but once again, you can change this to whatever you like. Upon completing the setup of your form, click the save and preview button in step two to see what you, your form will look like. And there's my form with my standard header and the text that I've selected for my title and above my form. What you see is exactly what the form will look like on your website. We have used monochrome colors so that the form will fit nicely with any website design. If you want to change any of the options for the form, simply close the pop-up make the desired changes, and click Save and Preview again. Once you are happy with the setup of your form, your personalized email or your personalized HTML link can now be copied to your website in order to add your lead capture form. The HTML code appears under step three. To copy the code, you can simply highlight it and click Copy by right-clicking your mouse and selecting the Copy option. You can now either copy the code directly to your website yourself or email it to your website designer to add it to your website for you. The code is simply a hyperlink address or URL that can be added to your website as a link or within an iframe. If these terms mean nothing to you, you probably have a website designer who takes care of your website. If so, he or she should know exactly what to do with the code. Now that you have set up your lead capture options, there are a number of settings that will determine what will happen each time you get a new lead. 
These settings are found near the top of the page under the New Lead Settings options, uh, New Lead Settings section, and apply to all new leads regardless of how they are captured. The first two checkboxes allow you to set how you would like to be notified of your new leads. You can receive email notifications, text notifications, or both. If you select to receive text notifications, you need to enter your mobile number and click the Send Verification Code button. Once you receive the code on your smartphone, enter it in the box under Verification Code and click the Verify button and you will start receiving text notifications of your new leads. The checkbox underneath provides you the option to automatically accept leads directly into your contact database instead of having to review and accept them in your utilities area. The next three options allow you to automatically apply default values to certain fields for your new leads. You can apply any combination of an original source of contact, you can assign a marketing activity plan automatically to new leads, and you can assign a contact group to new leads. For original source of contact and contact group, if the entry you wish to assign does not appear in the list, you can click the modify list link in order to add it. If you want to set up what is commonly referred to as an email autoresponder, you can set up a marketing activity plan with an email that is set to be automatically sent on the day the plan is initially assigned. This way, your new leads will receive an automatic email confirmation shortly after contacting you. You can use any co combination of the options described above to automatically receive new leads from any number of sources directly into your exact contact database and decide what happens when you receive each new lead.